The family drama between Britney Spears and her sister Jamie Lynn is intensifying big time. Britney's lawyer Matthew Rosegart just sent a cease and desist letter to Jamie Lynn as she continues to promote her memoir, Things I Should Have Said. The letter demands that you cease and desist from referencing Britney derogatorily during your promotional campaign. Then comes this stern warning. If you fail to do so or defame her, Britney will be forced to consider and take all appropriate legal action. Call her daddy. This week, Jamie Lynn appeared on the podcast Call Her Daddy. The host read this disturbing okay. excerpt right. from her book. You write, Brittany said to me, baby, I'm scared. And she took a large knife from the kitchen, pulled me along to my room and locked us both inside. I was really scary and I hated that that happened. But also like she must have been in pain too. But I was a kid. Like I didn't know what to do. The podcast and Jamie Lynn's entire publicity tour is infuriating Brittany. Today, she posted this expletive-filled rant. You selfish little brat. Blank you, Jamie Lynn. You shut me out when I needed you the most. Yikes. So, can a cease and desist order really keep Jamie Lynn quiet? A letter like this is pretty much doomed to failure. Either it's going to just generate more interest in the sister's book, or if it winds up in court, Brittany would lose because you have to show malice. You have to show you absolutely knew you were lying and trying to hurt somebody's reputation. Almost impossible to do. Despite all the sibling drama, Jamie Lynn says she still loves her big sister and always will. I love my sister, I'm her biggest fan, but guess what? Sisters are sisters or whatever, you know. Brittany denies the incident with the knife ever happened. Meantime, her legal team is accusing her father of pocketing more than $6 million from her earnings. He has not commented, but in the past, he said he's always acted in Brittany's best interest.